Hello there guys, today uh, I'm gonna to learn you how you can create the whiskey glass and so it's so easy, uh, we, we just in the Google uh, you can search the whiskey glass and any kind of the uh, glass if you want you can choose it, save the image and um, as usual you can import in the Maya here, uh, uh, import the image, image plan, or your or from the view, import the image. Uh, so it's so. Uh, I just import the image inside, uh, inside the, inside my send. So I just fixed it, and as you see. Uh, it's a rounded shape, so we can make it so fast with the uh, real uh, tools and with drawing lines. So in the front view, uh, I just start to drawing at the curve. So it's so easy. We just that place is the end of our cave. We can a little adjust that. <laughs> Just select. It's not too exact like that. I just show you the tools and I show you how you can create them. So okay, we come uh, come back to the um, perspective view. Select the uh, curve, delete the history, it's better, and uh, revolve. Use the uh, revolve as you see. So we create the shape of the glass. So it's uh, sometimes it's better you change 150. So it's better, it's more tidy and better. Okay. So as you see, we have a glass here, the shape of the glass. If you want, you can, a little from the front view, you can adjust it a little more. But I think this, oh, from here, we need a little more. You know, we can change the curve, so when you change the uh, curve, it's automatically update so yeah a little tiny we need more tiny here i think we need the point here so uh when the i when you select the curve right click and curve point you can add i uh, curve point and right click insert the knot so you have right now two more points and you have more more point for adjust and give the better shape to your glasses your glass yeah and something like this so i think right now it's better but i need to change the number the number of the wolf maybe more 2000 apply so glass is so good right now yep with the tree so yeah i think it's better right now <sighs> yeah uh, cool and a little more thickness here it's so tiny it's a little thickness so right now we have the shape of the glass right now we go to Edit, delete history, 
and select the curve and delete the curve. We don't need it anymore. So and so for inside we can use uh you can use the face of the glass right now just select inside shift point you can ex expand your selection i just check the how much we want to fill the glass no this one is better right click extract face select the object inside control one so select edge control e r extrude or we to control e r control e in right shift right click merge merge and in the mesh display reverse so we have the shape of the whiskey inside the glass two three three so we need more edge around that shift right click multi cut control and select here if the top Control here, and between another one here, so right now it's better. We can select this a little scale. So there we go. We have the shape, shape of the um, glass and the whiskey. We don't need this so because control shift and hit them. Uh, polygon. Um, I start with the cylinder. I want to make the ground and the side. So select the face. I don't need this part. Delete. I don't need this part to delete. And this face delete. So. There we go. Here, select the H, Control E W, Scale Control E W, extra that place. Okay, R scale. A little back. Okay, and another one. I I make a plane, so we don't need to mm, we don't need that subdivision. So it's better be one. A little scale. Uh, and uh, we can make our camera view uh, camera create the camera create camera and camera we can do perspective camera one a little scale in the perspective we can move it scale w okay so it's the view, uh, the render view. Make sure something like this, because I won't be make something like this picture. So I assign our my camera view. Maybe it's we don't need uh, a little bit. So. Yeah, it's better. So, uh, in the perspective, well, I want to add some material, and I want to render it with the uh, render 
uh, Redshift with the render engine Redshift. So I just select uh, select the plane, right click, assign new material, Redshift, Redshift material. So here for the color, I add the image. For the floor, I just download a picture uh, because it's the mm, laminate. So I just uh, find the laminate and put it there. So there we go. We have the laminate here and assign the material for the back. Mm, material, redshift, redshift. So it's, mm, I think it's a gray, a dark gray. So we choose something like this. And for the class, select the class, right click, assign new material, redshift, redshift material. Uh, in the reflection, uh, we, we don't we need the transparency so in the reflection weight must be one and for the IOR 1.1.52 1. 1. we are DF digits and um, we can add the light because our we don't have any light, so it is better. It's always, it's not better, it's always mm, turn off the default light and create a uh, light. Uh, redshift, light, doom light. So we have the doom light right now. For the inside, um, let's uh, take a render because it, I think it's, it's, it's better. I take a render for you yeah so as you see uh we have the a glass here uh we have the reflection on the ma uh, material of the the back so it's better uh change the material of back it's better uh, put the name pg Mat, enter uh, and put the zero of the weight. So right now uh, we don't have and we don't have the reflection on uh, back material. So for the floor we need a little roughness because here's a little roughness. So we in the reflection for this material. Uh, we see we send a floor mat. Let's add a little roughness and the reflection will tilt down. We can test it again. As you see, so it's a little better. But we don't have any reflection, so it's Better reflection a little more and roughness less. We can put only that place, and we can uh, use the render region and see the result. Maybe more in the roughness a little down. The region, okay. You can check the reference, yeah, something like this. And uh, so for for the inside, I think it's a little must be a little dark. We can use the. We can uh, we can just change the color gain a little here, and see the result. Yeah, I think it's good right now. And we have to change the material of the whiskey inside the glass. So just select, right click, assign new material, redshift, redshift material. 
and we say whiskey mat in the uh, refraction it's must wait one for refraction and one one point one 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 point five one ggx for the brtf and for the refract you know, service uh, subsurface we need the um, color of the whiskey i think something like this and the absorption scale 1.2 and i think it's good right now we have to change the maybe of the color oh it's so dark in the region it's a little lighter render so maybe one point one render a little lighter more light okay I think a little more light but the solution scale is one point two something like this so full render we can see the result a little better right now maybe the color must be more brown yeah. so it's good right now so we need uh, the light here and another light here. As you see, there is the effect of the light here and in the back. So we can simulate all of them here too. And I think the, it must be more darker on the floor. Uh, in the image, so here. Okay, so we start to add some um, other light light physical light scale w and here we have a light it's too intensity is too much so it's better put them maybe something like five and the visible turn off we can render again and see the result yeah it's a little better so you can play with the light and you can add more light and see the results. Let's um, better put it there, a little here. Yeah, we need another light order. Put the light here. A little it or smaller and I think it's intensity too it's good for that as you see the result change you can play with the light you can play with the material and um, you can change everything you want it but as a result, it's not too bad. <sighs> yeah, we have a different result. So thank you, all. thanks for watching this tutorial. And if you want, subscribe us and um, see you later.